Hi everyone. Right, today's little job, nice one for the polytunnel as usual because it's surprise, surprise, raining outdoors. Um, right, I've got a really, really nice plant. Now, this is a strange old story, boring one from when I was a lot younger. I thought these were mysterious plants that uh, were part of a, an old garden that I used to work in, which was a, a Victorian garden, and they had them up against the uh, old walls, and it was a I found later on it's a bulb and it's the agapanthus. Now the agapanthus just really exotic um, and they're just great. I mean I, I've, I've got these plants and they are, they're, they're, I'm just taking them out to be um, to show you because I'm going to plant these up next year but this is one plant. Now if I'll show you there this is from one plant they multiply so you can separate them there you go, there's one plant there. It's a little root, it's not huge, but it's one nonetheless. There's another one there, a little bit of root. I wonder if I can tease these as well. You can see, there we go. There's another one there. So out of that little bundle of one plant, there are, oh, I don't know, seven or eight, something like that. Now I'll put them back. So I was just going to show you that was basically what comes from a plant. You grow it up. Um, oh, what was this plant? How old? Um, 18 months, something like that. Um, nothing too much more than that. So you can imagine how this will spread and colonise and take over a little area. And they come up and they have these large flowers. So plant there. So about that, which is a couple of feet. Um, and they're all different types of colours you can have. This one's big blue, so nice big lump of flower, beautiful blue, um, and it's great. However, a good friend of mine said, oh, I've got some agapanthus seed. I've just saved them. So anyway, I brought them down, and he had them, and I was thinking, oh, I'll never get these to grow. Not in a million years. So anyway... I uh, decided to, uh, after, oh, I don't know, a month or two, thought oh, I'd better plant them up, show willing and all that. Um, anyway, I did. And uh, there you go. A year of growth. And not only that, guess what they started to do? Multiply. So they're even multiplying a bit now. So you take these out here. You've got one plant, two plants, three plants. Um, and I did not believe that I could go and get agapanthus from seed. Um, I'd go past now, there's a garden um, just up from where I live, and uh, they've got agapanthus growing in their front garden. And I keep on going by, and I see the, uh, um, the, the, the seed stems, and I keep on thinking, I should go in and just knock on their door and say, can I nick a couple, please? Because they will grow nothing fancy about the way I put them in as I said I didn't even put them in straight away I just took them out um, um, and after a month or so chucked them in some normal compost and they all came up uh, what confused me is I thought they were grass to begin with because they are very similar to that but all of these and this isn't all by the way this is one of three other trays that I've got full of them from three seed heads which is probably one large plant um as i said brilliant brilliant plant beautiful takes over a little area um you'll realize i am a big fan of plants that take over um i like taking over plants mainly reason because they make a bigger display and of course they cut down on the weeds and they are very good at self-weeding uh, and keeping them under control anyway that's all from me today later